Hello and welcome to our virtual tour of our 2008 Toyota Corolla. A little bit about our Sierra Pacific Toyota Lexus of Cairns, standing at one of two of our pre-owned vehicle yards. We'll go through about 200 vehicles in a month, making us the largest pre-owned vehicle department in Queensland. Showroom over the back there where we actually photograph each and every vehicle as they come through onto the yard. And as you can see, quite a variety here at our main yard just near DFO. Over there we've got parts and services attached just out the back of the brand new part of Toyota Lexus. And you make your way towards the city, you'll actually come across a second pre-owned vehicle yard as well. Throughout the video though, I'll be going around the 2008 Corolla here in complete detail, pointing out any blemishes that may appear at first point of sale. So we'll start down around the front, just making sure we've got nice tread there on the tyres. Now that is part of the roadworthy certificate, including that driveway price here in Queensland. Uh, but being a pre-owned vehicle, we want to be pointing out any little light markings, scratchings or imperfections. A couple around the front bumper there. Uh, but as we can see, no major dinks or dents or damages, so. But nice and clean and tidy. Even underneath, minimal or no markings and scratchings, which is always good to see. Across the bonnet, no dents. We're actually getting a great reflection there of the paint still as well, which is always excellent. Nice and clean and tidy around that front end. Down the passenger side, we'll cover each panel as we go. But that passenger front, again, there's plenty of tire tread. And just keeping an eye out for any of those markings and imperfections as we make our way down. Light little hairline marking just there on the passenger door. A couple of these very minor little imperfections that you would expect being a pre-owned vehicle. But as we can see, these markings are very light, very minor. Nothing that's actually dented the body and damaged it. Beautiful. That reverse angle, you can see that nice straight panel work. A little marking just there on the rear bumper. Yep. Great tire tread on the back there as well. So great to see that consistency as we're making our way around the vehicle. And a nice clean and tidy back end. As you can see no major dings or dents. No big panel damage from any accidents. Just a couple of those minor little wear and tear markings over time. That is to be expected on a vehicle of this age. Right. Well, we're back here, we'll have a look inside. Boots still in excellent condition. We'll look underneath, make sure we've still got our spare wheel and tools and everything in there as well. A parcel shelf, still in one piece. Sometimes you get a crack through the middle, so great to see that's still in good condition as well. Down the driver's side, again, nice and tidy. We'll keep covering each panel as we go. With that fourth and final wheel, it's an excellent tire tread as well. Beautiful. My little stone chips just there. But overall, we can see very clean and tidy around the exterior for its age, which is always great to see. And we've been getting that excellent reflection the whole way around the vehicle as well. The windscreen, making sure there's no major chips or cracks. Again, that is part of the roadworthy. And on the roof, no dings, dents or hail damage or anything like that. Uh, it's a little bit of fading on that rear spoiler, which is uh, extremely common when the vehicles start to get to this age. Interior-wise... Make sure there's no major wear and tear, scratching or scuff marks. Carpet flooring still in excellent condition. The same goes for the upholstery. No cuts, tears, stains, burns or anything like that. Beautiful and even that roof lining, as clean as can be. Driver's door though, obviously the most commonly used. So any wear and tear is likely to show up on this one here. So you've got the electric windows for the front. Uh, driver's footwell still in great condition and same for the driver's seat, which is always good to see. Yeah. Also, vehicle of this age, still got two keys, which is a nice surprise. But we'll start it up for you. Beautiful. You've got your electric side mirrors just here. Uh, you can see it's done 136,560 kilometers. We'll check that authenticity shortly with the service history. You make your way across, you've got your head unit there. As you can see, you've got CDs, you've still got an AUX connection and everything, and all your air conditioning controls just below. 
Now this is in a six speed manual, uh, which means reverse, just that little lever there to be able to access it. And your park brake in the middle here with a 12 volt just there. But up front, very clean and tidy like the rest of the vehicle's been. No damages or imperfections, no fading, cracking or stickiness across the dash. Again, part of that roadworthy. And we'll have a look in here, so just making sure we've still got the books. A bit of a flick through the service history one for you. The main one people do want to know about. So make our way back to the beginning. So it's done at 7,000 Ks. Done again there at 19,000. And then missed one service, but then done at 42, uh, 51, 58. Jumps to 90,000 Ks, uh, 95,000. 102,000, uh, 106,000, 110,000 Ks, uh, 113,000. So a little bit tricky with one hand here. Uh, 124,000, uh, 127,000, 132,000. So there must have been servicing due to time there. And I believe we've just done one uh, back here as well, as we've just obtained the vehicle, if I can find it for you. Which is, so it was done just here, I believe it's at 136,000 case. We've just serviced the vehicle there through our recon workshop. So next service isn't due till 147,000. So great service history, uh, all up to date and just been done. So a good bit of time till the next one. Last but not least though, we will jump out and have a look underneath the bonnet while she's still running. Uh, obviously make sure those services are paid off for you. So as we have a look underneath, make sure she's nice and clean and tidy. No rust or red dust, it's not like you'd expect it on a vehicle like this. But as we listen to that engine run, there's no major knocks, rattles or squeals either. But that was our virtual tour of our 2008 Toyota Corolla. I hope you enjoyed and I look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.